Setting up a DVR to connect to the network is simple and easy. Just follow these steps. Step 1. Connect a network cable to the DVR's network port. Step 2. Move the mouse pointer to the right-hand side of the screen and a pop-up menu will appear. Click on the Setup button located at the bottom of the menu. Step 3. Click on the Network icon. You will now be at the General Setup screen. Step 4. From here, you will see the Remote Watch settings. This allows you to change the video quality and resolution. The video quality can be set from basic to very high. The same setting options are available for the resolution. You can also change the images per second or bit rate and limit the network bandwidth to 1 gigabit per second or lower. Highlight the first box below Remote Watch, which is the BPS slash IPS. You can set the transfer speed from 50 kilobits per second to 1 gigabits per second. Highlight quality and select the quality options by scrolling over the option and clicking on the required setting. Highlight resolution and select the resolution options by scrolling over the option and clicking on the required setting. Step 5. You can limit the network bandwidth settings so that the system does not consume too much network bandwidth. Click on the box beside network bandwidth limit and press the up and down arrow buttons to set the desired maximum bandwidth from 50 kilobits per second to 1 gigabits per second. Note, when limiting the network bandwidth, the remote live view image on the PC running RAS plus IP or WebGuard will reflect the selected settings. For example, a higher bandwidth will provide a better image quality than a lower bandwidth setting. You can also enable the WebGuard service to provide remote viewing via Internet Explorer. To do this, click on the tick box as shown. Step 6. Click on the IP address tab and the IP address setup screen will appear. Next to the type box, select Manual from the drop-down list. This allows you to manually set up the LAN parameters. Note you will need to get the appropriate IP address, gateway, subnet mask and DNS server from your network administrator. Change the numbers by highlighting them in each of the fields and use the up and down arrow buttons to increase or decrease the value. Highlight the field beside the DNS server. Press the up and down arrow buttons to set the IP address of the DNS server. Step 7. Click on the port number setup box and the setup screen will appear. Note, you will need to get the appropriate port numbers from each RAS plus IP and WebGuard related program, admin, callback, watch and search from your network administrator. Change the port numbers by highlighting them and using the up and down arrow buttons to increase or decrease the number. We recommend using the factory default settings as shown on the screen. Note, the system restarts automatically after changing the port settings. Caution, when changing the port settings, you must change the port settings on the PC running RAS plus IP as well. Refer to the RAS plus IP manual for details. Step 8. Click on the Save button. You now have the options of connecting your DVR via RAS plus IP, WebGuard or select mobile devices. Thanks for viewing this video. We hope we have given you the assistance that you needed. Should you still have questions, please do not hesitate to contact your local branch.